Hey guys, they will meet one more time. A very warm welcome and a very good evening to all of you. Hope you guys are doing well, right? So guys, in my previous sessions, I've talked about so many things. I've tried to provide you the best knowledge about life, about career, how you can write down one professionalism, or what are the things you need to do in an HR interview, how you can prove yourself in an organization, what are the decorum you need to follow to work in an organization. So I've tried to provide you the best knowledge. You can go through my career uh, awarding series. The series name is Career Guidance by Deomita. So right now, in my today's series, uh, today's session, I'm going to talk about something that is the highest paying jobs in IT of 2023 and how you can get that jobs and what are the salary packages of that jobs I've tried to I will try to give you that knowledge okay so let's get started guys the first thing is uh, the first job role is software engineering manager in an administrative job reporting to upper management the role of a software engineering manager is to supervise and guide the work of the other software engineers on projects including the design and development of software programs and applications a software engineering manager generally needs at least a bachelor's degree in computer science or programming as well as several years of experience in a role of industry closely related in addition they must be skilled in programming languages and programs to contribute individually. So the average salary of a software engineering manager is 31.2 lakhs with most earnings between 13.1 lakhs and 94.5 lakhs annually. The top 10% of workers earn more than 43.9 lakhs annually. So guys, it's the top most highest paying job. Okay. Then the mobile application developer. The newest mobile gadgets and softwares are revolutioning how we interact with one another, do businesses and get news and entertainment. As a result, mobile app development has emerged as one of the most profitable and quickly expanding professions due to the widespread adoption of this innovative medium by businesses, consumers, programmers and creatives. Applicants have a massive advantage over the competition for this role if they have a computer science or information systems degree. The average annual income for mobile application developers in India is 5 lakhs with remuneration verifying from 1.8 lakhs to 12.3 lakhs. Then the third job role is information system security manager. A manager of information security is in charge of preventing computer viruses, security lapses, and harmful hacker attacks on a company's computers, networks, and data. Important and highly secret data may be lost if any organization's information technology systems are interrupted due to these types of the uh, intrusions. In addition to financial losses, Neglecting to project, uh, protect data can result uh, in fines for organizations. Therefore, companies must implement suitable security measures. So the information security managers in India get average, uh, average yearly pay for 16, um, 16 lakh rupees. So database manager. A database manager is in charge of creating and managing the systems and organizations uses to store and arrange data for businesses. They guarantee the security of the, of the data kept by installing several security procedures. Additionally, the database manager is responsible for overseeing the database uh, team's day-by-day -day operations and determining the data storage requirements for businesses. Computer science, management information systems, or similar subject bachelor's or associate's degree is required for the job. The average yearly earning for a database manager in India is 15 lakhs, with wages uh, ranging from 2 lakhs to 36.7 lakhs. Data security analyst. Data security experts ensure to keep computer networks and systems safe from viruses and hackers. They often do this job for specific companies guaranteeing the antivirus software and other security applications are current and functioning correctly. The assets of com a company's computer security procedures to find weaknesses and vulnerabilities and they recommend improvements as necessary to increase system security and efficiency. 
educationally any bachelor's study in information science or computer science might equip you for a job as a data security analyst. However, a bachelor of science in information security is a one degree program that is well targeted to the field. So data security analyst in India get an average yearly pay of five lakh rupees. Okay. So product manager. You have probably seen product manager on a list of the best paying IT jobs. A product manager works with the technical team to determine the product's parameters and then guides the development for the product from idea to launch. The job responsibilities of a product manager. Product managers are responsible for making an operating plan that can help achieve strategy and tactical goals and objectives. Building a product portfolio, managing and putting marketing plans into action, and contributing to the vision of the product strategy. Product lifecycle management is well understood in every way. Platforms for managing products like the pivotal uh, tracker, okay, then uh, Jira, Asana should be familiar to you. Good analytical skills, excellent time management abilities. The average yearly salary of a product manager is over 10 lakhs. So, then artificial intelligence engineer, an AI engineer or AI architect creates, manages, and keeps. AI projects in an organization under control. A person who designs AI should be very good at math and statistics. The, the, the job responsibilities of an AI manager is strong coding skills and knowledge of Python, R, and Torch. Figure out how TensorFlow and other technologies like it work know a lot about the technologies that are related to AI, such, uh, such as machine learning, neural networks and deep learning the average salary of an ai architect earns over 11 lakhs however you will find various highest paying jobs within the ai domain too so full stack developer by 2023 there will be over 27.7 million developers globally making it one of the highest paid it careers a full stack developer is difficult to define, but the closest definition would be someone who is fluent in both front end and back end development or has competence in every stage of the development process from design to completion. The job responsibilities of a full stack developer. Utilized technologies include MongoDB, ExpressJS, AngularJS, and Node.js. How to design and implement an API, programming and scripting, the fundamentals of website design, introduction to database technology. A full stack developer may be responsible for building and constructing APIs using mean stack technologies, ensuring the resulting apps are responsive and compliant with the applicable standards, testing the code's integrity and implementing data security. The average uh, yearly salary of a full stack developer is 10 lakh, okay? So cloud architect, the next best paying job in technology is being a cloud architect. A cloud architect puts an organization's cloud computing strategy into action and take care of it. The job responsibilities like that, a full understanding of how cloud applications architect wo architecture works, expertise with cloud platform from Amazon Web Services, Microsoft, Azure, and Google, okay? Strong ability to talk to people. A cloud architect is in charge of defining cloud architecture, making a cloud strategy, and managing its implementation and deployment. They also ensure that application architecture and deployment in the cloud environment are done correctly, okay? So the, the average yearly salary of a cloud architect is 10 lakhs. However, within the cloud computing field too, you will find various job roles and responsibilities that, that pay handsome uh, salaries and you can find about the cloud highest paying jobs. Okay, so DevOps engineer. The DevOps engineer position is next on the list of the best paying tech jobs. It could mean a member of the development team who helps with deployment and network operations. Or it could mean a member of the operations team who work on application deployment. Some of the skills a DevOps engineer needs are coding and writing scripts and knowing how to set up and run a network 
Git and uh, Jenkins. Okay, system management skills with Linux or Unix. A DevOps engineer may be in charge of creating and maintaining a deployment infrastructure, connecting cloud services to automate process or sh uh, shell programming in PHP, Python, or Ruby. So, the average yearly salary of a DevOps engineer ranges from five lakh to fourteen lakh. Then the blockchain engineer. A blockchain engineer is an expert in designing and putting in place architecture and solution based on the blockchain. Blockchain uh, experts will be uh, in high demand in many industries and places by 2023. The world is expected to spend more than uh, 15.9 billion on blockchain solutions. A blockchain engineer should be good at Programming and know a lot about Ripple, R3, Ethereum, and the Bitcoin technologies, as well as the consensus processes, security protocol stacks, and crypto libraries and functions. The average yearly salary of a blockchain engineer is over 15 lakh. Okay. You can also download the blockchain engineer uh, career guide to know the learning path top skills uh, and ways to build a successful career in the field and also get an in-depth understanding of why it is referred as one of the highest paying jobs. So guys, these are the job options today I have talked about. In my another session, I'm going to describe some more job options. Okay. So if you find my videos are helpful, kindly subscribe my channel, hit the bell icon and comment. And kindly share it with your family, friends, and other people also. In PCS Global, we are providing the training in all those technologies like uh, Java DevOps in Python, in Ruby, in uh, AI, and Java DevOps, uh, Salesforce, okay? So, Java full stack, mount stack, main stack. So, if you are a candidate who wanted to start your career, right now we are looking for better opportunities. We are here to help you. We have our own project. We have our uh, CELP pro project. That is our on-job training project. You can join that project also. And you can get the best from our side. So, PCS Global is the India's number one talent management company. We train people. We deploy people. So if you are a candidate who right now who is looking for better opportunities, kindly communicate with us. Our working sessions are going on. Our master classes are going on. Every weekend you can join our master classes to get the best knowledge about the uh, uh, about coding, how the uh, projects we need to do, and whatever the things you need to understand. We are here to help you. So kindly uh, find out the best for yourself. And in my videos, there is the uh, in my description box the links are given. So if you are thinking to join uh, in our webinars or master classes, correct number directly. Uh, click on the link and do register yourself. Okay. So what you need to do right now, you need to uh, prepare yourself to be a part of IT scenario. And as per the uh, job market in IT, whatever I have talked about, what information I have given you, that is the best paying jobs. I will give you uh, more information about it in my next series, okay, or next session. So right now, this is for uh, today's session. We have uh, two centers in Bengaluru. You can go over there. You can visit over there. The first one is located in uh, 91 Outer Springboard. Marathali Mahadevpura and our second office is located in BTA layout. So kindly visit over there and our con uh, concerned persons will be there. Connect with them and get the best knowledge for you. Okay. So bye guys.